Hi, the question that I have today, I'm sure, is going to delight you. There is this father and son talking to each other. Father says to son, I just realized that switching the digits in one's place and tens place of my age gives your age. To which the son replies, I just realized that tomorrow you'll be exactly twice as old as me. Your task is to find out their age today. Don't be too quick to answer. The question definitely requires some thinking. Now, if you'd like to do some thinking yourself, you might pause the video because I'm very excited to tell you the answer. The very first thing that we'll have to do is to assume their ages today. Let the father's age today be 10x plus y and the son's age today be 10y plus x because it says switching the tens and ones digit of the father's age gives the son's age. Here x and y are digits from 0 to 9. Now another information that's been given in the question is tomorrow the father will be twice as old as his son. Now what does it mean? It can mean three things. One can be that it's the father's birthday tomorrow. Another can be it's the son's birthday tomorrow. And the third can be it's both their birthdays tomorrow. Now for case one, let's see what will happen if it's the father's birthday tomorrow. It's the father's birthday tomorrow means he is going to be one year older tomorrow compared to what he is today. In that case, his age tomorrow will be 10x plus y plus 1. But the son, even tomorrow, will remain as old as he is today. Now the question says, tomorrow the father will be twice of his son's age. Therefore, we will equate the father's age tomorrow to twice his son's age tomorrow, which means 10x plus y plus 1 equals to 2 10y plus x. Let's work it out. It gives us 10x plus y plus 1 equals to 20y plus 2x or 8x plus 1 equals to 19y or y equals to 8x plus 1 by 19. Now our work is to find out the values of x and y that satisfy this equation. A couple of attempts and we'll find that when x is equal to 7, y is equal to 3. This means x equals to 7 and y equals to 3 satisfy the equation. We put the value of these in their current ages and find the father's age to be 73 years and the son's age to be 37 years. Now when the dad will turn 74 tomorrow, the son's age will still be 37 and the father will be twice as old as his son tomorrow. Therefore, 73 and 37 can be one possible answer. Let's move to case 2, supposing it's the son's birthday tomorrow. It's the son's birthday tomorrow means he's going to be one year older tomorrow compared to what he is today. In that case, his age tomorrow will be 10y plus x plus 1. But as for the father, he will remain as old as he is today even tomorrow. Because the father will be twice as old as his son tomorrow, we'll equate the father's age tomorrow to twice his son's age tomorrow. Which means 10x plus y equals to 2 10y plus x plus 1. Let's work it out. It gives us 10x plus y equals to 20y plus 2x plus 2. Or 8x minus 2 equals to 19y or y equals to 8x minus 2 by 19. We can find that x equals to 5 and y equals to 2 satisfies this equation. Therefore, the father's current age is 52 and the son's current age is 25. So, when the son will turn 26 tomorrow, his dad, who will still be 52, will be twice his son's age. Therefore, 52 and 25 is another possible answer. Now, let's move to the third case. Supposing it's both their birthdays tomorrow. It's both their birthdays tomorrow means the father will be 10x plus y plus 1 tomorrow and the son will be 10y plus x plus 1 tomorrow. We'll again equate the father's age tomorrow 
with twice his son's age tomorrow and this gives us 10x plus y plus 1 equals to 2 times 10y plus x plus 1 or 10x plus y plus 1 equals to 20y plus 2x plus 2 or 8x minus 1 equals to 19y or y equals to 8x minus 1 by 19. We'll find that no values of x and y satisfies this equation. So this can't be the case. Case one and case two, however, give us two possible solutions to the problem. That is, the father and son can either be 73 and 37 today, respectively, or 52 and 25 today, respectively. Hope you liked the video. Feel free to comment for suggestions and opinions and your experience with the question. Do not forget to like and subscribe to the channel because it's your involvement that helps the channel do better.